Welcome to the fourth take of Portal, or the third take of Portal. Uh, this is, man. I've had a bunch of audio issues the first time. First, the game was too loud and you couldn't hear me. The second time, I was too loud and you couldn't hear the game. It was a big mess. Hopefully, I've, uh, I'm alt I've altered the settings over here, so hopefully i fixed everything. So we're going to be playing through about the first half of Portal today, and, or the first half of the levels today, and then uh, we will uh, we will play the the other half some other point. Uh, you might notice my setup's a little different on here, which is uh, I've got the face cam as always, and then uh, down I've got a slightly altered version of the yeah I've got a slightly altered version of the watermark down below. Uh, it's it's just got the dot weebly dot com to make, so it's kind of like a, a some it's kind of like a, a a watermark for the website kind of. Um, that's not gonna be that's just gonna be one of the many variations of that logo I'm gonna make. It's not gonna be like that's not replacing the one that it is now. I'm gonna stick. I think the way I'm gonna work with this logo is I'm gonna stick with that. Lo I'm gonna stick with the. The basic gray background, blue circle, black outline, the groovy game zone logo, and then I'll just kind of make variations upon it as I go along. But the one you see on the website and the one you see that's the YouTube channel background is probably going to be the kind of the basic one, the the original, the the main one, I guess, is what I'm trying to say here. And then I've got the game on this side. Oh, technically, it's to my left. It's to the left of the webcam, but this is registering as left on the webcam. So this way, I've got the portal game. And uh, yeah, this is my. I like this a lot better than the one than this. This is what I would have been doing had I not figured out how to do this. So yeah, you would have been having to see all my icons and everything, and would not have been as cool. But yes, we have this. I wonder if I, I think I'm going to do this for Roblox too. That'll be really cool. So yeah, I like this a lot better than the one I was using. But yeah, anyways, let's load. No, new game. I want a new game, and we'll start the new game. Turn my speaker up enough that I can hear the. I, so I can hear the game, but it's not going to be picked up too much by the mic. I don't want this game to be picked up too much by the mic. I think I fixed it. Got a timer there. I've beaten this game I don't know how many times, so if I'm going through these levels a little fast, yeah, it's because I've more or less memorized them all. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Admission Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation box has been a pleasant one. Some of this stuff gets really old after you've read it 10, 20 times. And we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before That's we start, however, great. keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur for your own safety and the safety of others. Please refrain from the portal will open in three. Two, one. Portal alright. And we are on level zero. So level zero through ten. Or no, level zero through nine is what we're gonna be playing today. And then we'll save ten through nineteen Excellent. for some other time. Please proceed into the chamber Another time when Roblox doesn't work. Test. First, however, note the incandescent yeah, Roblox particle works, field across uh, the exit. This aperture science Roblox, material yeah. emancipation this is pretty much the grid will vaporize portals, any unauthorized equipment that passes recently, through right it. Today, so. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. I'm probably going to be talking over GLaDOS because I really don't care to hear what she has to say. This is not, this is not, if you want to hear a lot about the story, this is not the video you want to be watching. Because I'm going to be talking over quite a bit of the game. Although hopefully, I, ho I, I, hope, you, I hope you can still hear the game. Perfect. 
Please move quickly to the chamber. Look, I've, I've, this is my third hit because I'm trying to. I'm trying to get it. Test. Uh, perfect with the audio. Not perfect, maybe, but I'm trying to get it well enough with the audio that you can hear the game and my voice, but one's not really like overpowering the other. So yeah. I swear, if I have to take a fourth take, though, that's gonna be after I eat lunch. I'm pretty hungry right now. <laughs> I think I'm gonna make myself, uh, oh my god, I eat something. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I make, like, a ham, uh, yeah, turkey wrap or something. I'll have a glass of some Hawaiian punch, the, uh, berry... Limeade Blast or whatever, Hawaiian Punch. It's pretty good. Maybe a glass Very of water good. too. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. Come back down here and visit. You can create uh, your own some. portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. I'm gonna, I'm gonna guess the operational end. I have not been able to figure out this out. I'm gonna guess the operational end is where the portals come in liquid, even partially. I Most guess it's the only part that's operating, no so... That makes sense. Can I fling myself all the way Please over there? Please proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. Oops. Interesting if I could try to lie, if I couldn't punch myself. Well, if I could just keep remember, throwing myself the off. Science, bring your daughter to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. Until I, I could keep uh, cycling myself until I ended up in the floor. Or on the other floor, or on the uh, other part of the gap that you can. The other side of the gap. I could be using, I could be playing this with my controller, but, or not my controller, but a controller. For some reason, this controller does not seem to kind of work. I cannot figure out why that is. Welcome to test if I have to take a fourth take, maybe I will try to play with the controller. Oh, I made it through the portal. Or I made the, I got the cube to go through the portal. As part of a required test protocol, I mean, I usually can do that, but uh, the first chamber. take I wasn't able to. It will be entirely to. on your own. Good luck. I was thinking Spongebob music for it. Alright, this was super cool the last time I did this. Oh, wait. Okay, so this is the way I- Okay, can I kick it over? Darn, no, I, I want to kick it over. The way I did this before was that I, I think I pushed, put another portal here, and I, like, kicked this cube, and it- But it landed. But it, instead of kind of tumbling like it just did, it, like, flew all- It got, like, thrown all the way over there. By my powerful landing skills. Oh, that was so cool. Uh oh. Oh, that's right. I can't do that yet. Forgot. As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Yeah, I never want to after Good this. job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. Alright, I think this is level 10. I think this is where we're gonna end it off for today. Level 10. No, this is level 6. I don't know why- oh, well, I don't know why I thought that was level 5. Does not go from level 5 to 9 to 10. I don't know why I asked that. Maybe I thought 5 and 9 looked similar for some reason. I don't know. That was weird. Still got three more tests to go. Two more tests to go now. So dumb of me. <sighs> I 
want to see a Portal Half-Life crossover. I haven't actually played the first Half-Life, but I've played a little bit of Half-Life 2. It's pretty fun. It's pretty, cool. it's a pretty cool game. I like that game. It'd be really cool. You'd be able to, like, send the head crab zombies through one portal, and then you'd be able to, like, throw them out the other into the, uh, into, like, the deadly water stuff. Now use the aperture science on stationary scaffold to reach the chamber lock. Or you could... Oh, I wonder if they would count as equipment. And maybe you could send them through the uh, chamber lock? Or not the chamber lock, through the uh, emancipation grid? I bet not. I don't know. You do some crazy things with that. With enemies and stuff, but that'd be so cool. I wonder if this has a. I wonder if Half Life 2 has got the same developer console that Portal does. Because I know the games came packaged together originally. Um, crap, I, I've, I've missed that like every time. I've missed that, that shot. But yeah. I wonder if that'd be so cool if they do have the same developer's console. That way I could, I could add in the Portal gun. <laughs> that would be so entertaining. But then again, I'd need Half Life 2. I want to play Half-Life 1, really, before I play Half-Life 2. Yeah, I've got the orange box Very collection impressive. on Xbox 360. That that, so that's how I have is merely a device to enhance your testing sure. experience. Well, let's see, that comes with like Half-Life 2, the uh, the DLC, so that's the episode 1 and 2, that's the DLC. And then Portal, which is, I think, the way I first played Portal. I think that's also the way I first played Portal. To inform you that this and then, uh, I don't know if I'd be, oh, I don't know if I'd be no Portal through PC or through the Xbox. Either way, um, yeah, I don't exactly remember, but then, oh, and then, but then, um, it comes with also, oh, it's come with Team Fortress too, but I don't have Xbox Live. Or Xbox Live Gold. For in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. Can't play that. Anyways, uh, I've been, I went about two minutes over last take. Anyway, uh, this has been the first part of the original Portal. I'm Austin, and I will see you guys.